Phillies post game live, presented by our friends Jeez. at Cure Auto Insurance. Down to the last strike, Ricky. That's Bolson. unbelievable. Ruben Amaro awesome. Jr. Last strike, fan. one yeah. swipe, boom, it's well, gone. The way the game was going, the Phillies were 0 for 10 at that point with runners in scoring position. You're thinking to yourself, I mean, obviously he just threw two nasty sliders. One of them was probably a strike. The other one was just off the plate, and then. All of a sudden, you hang one to a lefty. Oh, you can see. I love the replay. He stubs his eyes. I mean, tripled in size yeah. when that ball was yeah. coming in. That and is so such ours. a good feeling when you see that ball hanging. Well, not for a pitcher, but for Stubbsy. <laughs> That's was. right. For Stubbsy, it certainly was. B-C-I-B. Yeah. But you know what? We're sitting there saying, hey, you know, just save Kyle Schwarber his ups. Just And they didn't need He didn't need to. He no. took care of it himself. To me, Michael, was about uh, I, all I could think about was, Oh, my goodness. Kyle Gibson threw one of the greatest games he's ever thrown in his life. And the guy's not going to get a W out of this. I mean, he was spectacular when they really needed him. And uh, it wasn't going to work out. And here we go into the ninth inning, and we get a huge, huge home run from Garrett Stubbs. And, and you know what? The most impressive thing about this is he's playing against the left-hander. Uh, he's giving JT a, a day off. But not, not only is he, like, doing a good job offensively, but he's catching extremely well. He's calling great games. I don't know what his catcher's ERA is right now, but he, every, every time he's out there catching, he's doing a really good job of keeping these guys in the game. So, BCIB? Three, one, well, you know what? He's vying for it after a game like today. Uh, he, the Phillies win at 3-1. They are back above 500, which is crucial. And as mentioned at the very top, they had won those nine straight, and they started waffling again. And this is the type of game that you need to have. You're closing out a homestand with a winning record now, and it wouldn't have been a winning record without a win like this. I, I think the way we look at it, because we're in the media, we're not in that clubhouse, is we're kind of waiting for the, the other shoe to drop. Right, uh, we're watching the ball games, saying, "Okay, it's been walk off after walk off after walk. Sooner or later, this stuff's going to wear out." I mean, you do, you love these games as a player, like the finish, as long as you win these games. But uh, sometimes the shoe goes on the other foot, and everything kind of flip flops on you. I think fan the fan base is waiting for that that to go the other direction. I'm not so sure this team is going to let it go in the other direction. Yeah, and I think that's the mark of a team that's going to contend right to the very end and hopefully get over that threshold and into the playoffs. But we still have the remainder of the season to go. And I would say thank goodness because it's going to be fun, hopefully, to continue to watch them. Let's go across the street, check in with John Cruck, who called today's game with Tom McCarthy. John, before we get to the game, was that an awesome call by T-Mac or what? I mean, you sit next to him just about every single game. That was a thing of beauty. Yeah, he, he is, uh, you know, first and foremost, he's a Phillies fan, and he loves this team, and uh, he announces that way with passion. And what would you expect? I mean, you're in Philadelphia. If you don't have passion, get the hell out, man. Yeah. But, uh, you know, it, 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 it is. It, like, like. I watched the ball up the bat of Stubbs, and then I watched T-Mac, see what he's going to say. It's, it's, it's incredible. Inside the box score of a come from behind, three to one Phillies win. And they have six, uh, excuse me, eight hits today. Two from Reese Hoskins, two from Alec Bohm, and two from the player of the game, aside from pitcher Kyle Gibson, and that would be Garrett Stubbs with the game winner. Here's Rob Thompson on a big Phillies win. Kind of fun to see some of these guys that have never, you know, Bryson, Bryson had his first walk-off hit last Sunday, and see Garrett kind of step up today. It's fun to see those guys do that for the first time. Yeah, it is. And, you know, Stubby, he's a, he's a baseball player. You know, he knows how to play the game, and he'll bunt for a base hit. He'll do anything to win. And so I'm, I'm really happy for him to have that walk-off hit. Does the offense surprise you? I mean, because you looked at his, he just didn't have a lot of opportunities coming into the season. He's really hit the back. Yeah, he really has. And, and that's a tough spot to be in because you don't play for five or six days and then you got to take down at bats. And, um, you know, today against the left hander, it was just because of JT's day off. But he put out, laid out good at bats. And then the left hander at the end, who's really good and tough on lefties, he, you know, I don't know, I don't exactly know what the pitch was, but. He turned it around, one ball game for us. That, that was, the, there was Scott's, I think it was his 32nd pitch of that inning. Yeah. Did you feel like you guys uh, were able to kind of wear him down and get to that point where kind of hung one there? Yeah, and he pitched last night too, so. Um, but he's got good stuff, and he's really tough on left-hand hitters. So um, so I'm, I'm just happy for Stubby, I really am.
Were you aware as the game was called out, that the channel in runs, runs the score position before that hit? Yeah, yeah. For, yeah, you know, I, I thought we had decent at bats today, and, and their guy did a nice job on us. Um, but, you know, you got to overcome that stuff and just keep grinding and keep battling right to the end. I've been here for a while. Uh, you guys haven't beat the Marlins. Seems like it's tough to beat those guys. What's it like to win a series against Well, Vegas? it feels good to win a series against anybody, and that's our fourth in a row, so that feels pretty good. But, yeah, and getting back to winning – Inside your division is huge. So now we got five against Washington, and, and uh, go down there and play some good baseball. Rob, JT's a guy who loves to play as much as he can, maybe more than any other catcher in mm -hmm. the sport. Uh, when you have a backup who is forming a little more, might it give you a chance to give JT maybe maybe once a week instead of once every two weeks, uh, just because Stubbs has played the way he's playing? Yeah, I mean, Stubbs played great. And I'm not sure what our record is when he's catching, but uh, I would. It seems like the, the last few times he's caught, we've won. And um, he does a great job. He takes a lot of pride in, in running the game for his pitchers. Um, he lays out good at bats. He's a baseball. He's a good base runner. So, you know, it, you feel good when he's in the lineup. Uh, the one thing that you have to love about Stubbs, he never gets rattled in pressure situations. You saw that in that mm -hmm. at-bat right there. And now they are, uh, what, four straight series they have won. Sure. Here is Garrett Stubbs in the clubhouse on his big hit. Yeah. Um, pretty cool moment to even, you know, get the opportunity to be in that position. Uh, you know, great eight Bs before me to get on and then uh, for me to have the uh, chance to hit a homer there to get us to win. Uh, you know, we do everything I can to uh, stay prepared for any moment, maybe not that one specifically, um, but just to be ready for any game. So um, it was it was a lot of fun. I mean, how did you feel in that moment? I mean, it had, probably hadn't been in. Uh, I couldn't tell you. <laughs> a lot of excitement, uh, a lot of adrenaline. Uh, by the time I got home and uh, everyone was crowding me, I felt like I was going to throw up afterwards. So uh, the adrenaline was 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 awesome. Uh, really good feeling. Uh, you know, great way to end a series and then go to Washington.